So we're here at the Red Bull Dual Ascent, first man-made multi-pitch climbing competition putting the world's strongest climbers against each other. We've already eyed up the crack feature right in the center of the finals route. And because we love crack climbing, we wanted to pitch the finalists against each other in our very own wide boys competition to see who has the best jamming knowledge. First up, we have Yoni Kruder and Domin Skofik who have both won world titles on the international competition circuit and together as a team are competing in the Red Bull Dual Ascent Final. Can we do a little interview? I want to test you on two crack moves. Oh, okay. I'm going to be the crack. Ha! Okay. I'm going to improvise. <laughs> <laughs> I still don't know many of the things. So. Yeah, you're going to love I hope this. we're not talking uh, about the... the the, the crack of yours. What is an armbar? An armbar. Ooh, Ooh interesting. Oh. <laughs> interesting. Interesting. And this interesting. One, I guess you could do it like this or what? Ooh, slightly different to Yerni. Ooh, that's, that's getting... That's closer. Yeah. That's I think that's above Yerni. Compromise between chicken, oh, man. Yeah, 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 chicken yeah. and armbar. Oh, yeah, 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 okay. Very yeah. good. Can you complete? A wide pony. White pony, oh man. And I'm gonna say this. I didn't listen to you guys do it. This is a roof crack. Okay. And it's a, a roof crack. crack. Yes, yeah, a roof crack. You might need to take your bag off, that's a clue. Okay, shit, eh? Mm. Is it pretty much? Huh? Here, the, the, the hips are the, the thing, no? It's going like how it's going? Like, it's like, like, yeah, that, like yeah. this. Yeah. And this is like roof, like this. Yeah. yeah okay, yeah. okay, okay. Jesus. <laughs> this is like, oh, this is a knee bar. Think of a wide pony. Wide pony. Like a really big pony. Oh, yeah. Yes. Yeah. 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 <laughs> yeah. Okay, you kind of twist your ankles inside. Huh? Okay. I mean, it's something. <laughs> yeah. Something. It's not quite what we were expecting, but it's, it's close. You lock it like this. Yeah. Ooh, like this and uh. Hands? Maybe. That wasn't quite the right answer. Okay. Ooh. <laughs> well, you good effort, though. Good, huh? You seem confident. Yeah. I think this is the thing that we're going to really score you high on is knowledge may not be 10 out of 10. Okay. But confidence is high. Good. <laughs> yes. Everyone who's a White Boys fan wants to know what the pros think of the crack. What's your opinion? It's like a hand jam. And it's so good that I didn't want to spend like time on like grabbing it more than one time like one oh that's good uh, I really like the crack actually I was a, a little bit afraid because I've never seen it like uh, what, like two volumes like open crack when I came in like I fitted perfectly so it's actually like an open crack uh, I haven't experienced before but uh, it's in my opinion the most like uh, universal crack so nobody can say it's more for something you know you can fit like perfectly like if you have bigger hands you're more on the outside if you have smaller on the inside so uh, I'm happy I'm slowly starting to learn this, uh, this style and uh, yeah it's fun when you do it it's not even like painful anymore so it's yeah. nice. Next entry to the crack competition is Stefano Gasolfi. Stefano is well known for his outdoor sport climbing having climbed many of the hardest routes in the world. We've also seen him recently checking out the world's hardest route, Silence, using some jams through the crux of this. Let's see what his crack knowledge is like. In the qualifier, you had your first experience with the crack. <laughs> How would you summarize the crack? I tried to jam, and then uh, I, like, I was slipping off, so I decided to take like this and go like this. Double hand, like top, 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 top. So I'm going to give you two crack techniques that okay. you have to demonstrate. Do we have a crack here? Sort of. Okay. Your <laughs> lovely <laughs> partner, who's going to be your crack, and I would like you to demonstrate an arm bar. Mettere più verticali. I will do like this, like this. Okay, it's not so this quite right, but equal points. Yep. Okay. All to play with. So you're going to squat like this and have <laughs> oh, wow. this width here. Mm. Okay. And you have to do wide pony. Wide pony. So <laughs> it's a roof crack. So I'm yes. under. Yes. Yes. So you're underneath okay. it. <laughs> <laughs> this, like this, think off width. So what you might do with your hands? Like, like what are you actually going to do with your hands at that width? Oh, what we, look at the way oh, the hands is. Yeah, okay, okay, yeah, okay, yeah, okay. yeah, 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 yeah. This is looking good. The feet, feet, are not feet right. need some corrections. <laughs> and think how you might ride a wide pony. No, like. 
that's a narrow pony. <laughs> yeah, that's a narrow one. It's nice. It's decent. Yeah. I think we might need to go to count back. Yeah, we might need to go to count back, yeah. <laughs> Thank you, Craig. Yeah. <laughs> that's an excellent oh. entry to the competition. Okay, nice. So Stefano went on to take third place at the Red Bull Dual Ascent. Although we didn't see him jamming that much on the route, I'm quite sure by spring we'll have him jamming up all sorts of things. Next up, we have Luca Potica, who is the current lead world champion, and Alberto Hines Lopez, the current Olympic champion. These guys are a team competing against Yerne and Domen in the final. Let's see what their crack knowledge is like. We have Alberto. How is the crack for you? I don't know, I had to fake it. <laughs> <laughs> when I arrived there, I didn't even try to, to do it in the original way, so I just fake it. What does faking it mean? It was way easier if you know how to to fit uh, your fist in there. So I'm gonna be the crack. What is an armbar? Holy shit, this is too wide. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe like this. I don't know. Ooh. Yeah. <laughs> Probably I will put like my work arm inside, like so something like pressing like this. I don't know. Uh, yeah, decent. Decent. Okay. Yeah, 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 yeah. So that's the equal best answer. Next one is called a wide pony. Wide pony? Yeah. Okay. So how do you use a wide pony? Yeah, I think it's a good idea. <laughs> do I have to use my legs? Yeah, maybe. Oh, yeah, 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 oh, yeah. get closer. Just keep thinking, wide pony. Maybe like this, so you fit jam. Something like this. Ooh, Ooh this, is this is strong. This is very close. So, no, how am I supposed to fit this? <laughs> you just need to complete the hands and you and then you can be the winner. This is your chance to be <laughs> this is to take gold again. <laughs> yeah, that's a little okay. better. Yeah, okay. yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm learning uh, German. Oh, oh, very close. Oh. <laughs> okay, now your feet. What? what now your feet at the same time? <laughs> they crash, they... <laughs> Nine out of ten. It's just um, like the back of the hand, okay. so rather than this way. Yeah, yeah, like, yeah, you can uh, yeah. Luca and Alberto seem keen to learn a little bit more, so we gave them a basic crack school lesson just before they competed in the finals that afternoon. We're gonna get loads of pressure here, like really squeeze hard. Like much more pressure on your hands and fingers. When your hand is in here, is to learn that you can not have this back section of right. the crack. So you know when on the competition route, it's more flared. Right. So you'll only be able to maybe get half of the hand, which is good. So it's in here, it's just jamming on the front two here and the thumb. So never stop at this point, go just a little deeper. Now, yeah, so that's maybe too far. There is perfect because you're all the way of this is yeah, in contact. Yeah, 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 okay. yeah, and then I think push a lot harder with this. Yeah, and that should be rock hard. I think the problem is that I, I'm, I don't have trust in this now. Is if you slightly turn, yeah, rotate. turn like yeah, ro yeah. rotate the wrist, is it just it makes it jam in better? Yeah, yeah, yeah. but like only a little, not yeah. like the elbow up here. Yeah, just, <laughs> just like a, li a little. Uh, I'm going to try it in, try it in the room. Uh, I don't know. Not fair, you're giving <laughs> them lectures. Come on, that was our only like chance to win because we know how to yeah, crack them. Now they know how to do we it. We can try and then see. <laughs> After our crack school, Luca and Alberto competed against Domen and Yerne in the final. Luca took his newfound jamming skills and applied them to the route. They came away with a win at the Red Bull Dual Ascent. However, we still had one final entry in the jamming knowledge competition, which was Magnus. Could the Y boys crack climbing? that we've done with him in the past steal victory for him to give him the Y Boys Crack Knowledge competition title. Okay, Magnus. Yep. You have been on the wall. How hard is that crack section? I mean, I suck at cracks and I thought it was easy. So it's easy. I think this might be one of the first times I've heard you say that the, the cracks are easy. Yeah. This, this is good. This crack is easy. No, there's improvements here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because yeah, yeah, some yeah. people don't think it's easy. Yeah, yeah so I know, I know. Better. This is easy. This is definitely easy crack. So all our training has been paying off. Yes, I think. <laughs> a little bit at least. Yeah, I think it has. It was all leading up to this moment yeah, right yeah, here. Yeah. <laughs> I'm going to then give you a crack. Uh -huh. and you have to demonstrate the technique. Seriously, it's all to play for because the okay. scoring so far... Nobody's got 100%. I got nervous. <laughs> yeah. Hands are sweaty now. Armbar. Yeah. Is this an armbar? 
Okay. Okay. Ooh, okay. Right. Okay. I'm going to be here. Mm -hmm. And I am the roof crack, and you have to do a wide pony. I know I, I I don't remember a wide pony at all. But uh, I'm just trying to think of the easiest way. Riding a wide pony, That's something cool. you do with your legs. When you ride a wide pony, you you do this. Yeah, 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 yeah. You, you're totally on the right thing here. So think now about the <laughs> the roof crack that's above you. But this is so narrow, though. What are you doing in here? I don't understand. So you put your legs on the side then? But why would you? Okay, so you're <laughs> so, doing like this but what do you do with your legs though i don't understand 3d 3d, 3D. Like a spin get a spin in there like a skateboarder a switch get a switch in get a switch in. like goofy goofy and your clues don't <laughs> give me anything arm bar is is this way dropping it all like okay here. Okay. when you were like like this yeah you had to just rotate go okay i would have yeah. never gotten that did you so try close. You did it. Yeah. Oh man! But I did like this. Yeah. And like this. Oh, okay. Got the, st the stack wrong. Yeah. Yeah. I think yeah. I think you might be. I think you could I think be Alberto in. Alberto is champion. Could be the, the champion. Crack. Double, 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 champion. Double, double, double champion. <laughs> so the scores. Who knows their armbar from their chicken wing and their wide pony from their trout tickler? Well, I think the results speak for themselves. Feast your eyes on that leaderboard. Huge thanks to all the athletes that took part in our competition. We've got some big crack collabs with more top level climbers on their way. So if you don't want to miss out on them, then you should definitely consider subscribing.